space, the final frontier, a dark canvas sprinkled with the light of billions of stars. Each star, some smaller than ours, some unimaginably larger. Around these stars, planets spin, some rocky, some shrouded in gas. And then there are galaxies, vast islands of stars, gas, and dust. We find ourselves tucked away on a spiral arm of the Milky Way galaxy. We look out into the universe with awe and wonder. Before we embark on our cosmic adventure, let's consider our place in the universe. Our cosmic address starts with our solar system, a family of eight planets orbiting the Sun. Our solar system resides in the Milky Way galaxy, home to hundreds of billions of stars. The Milky Way is just one of billions of galaxies that fill the observable universe. Our journey through the universe will take us to the heart of galaxies, where supermassive black holes lurk. We will witness the birth and death of stars, marvel at swirling clouds of gas and dust giving rise to planets. Prepare to have your mind stretched to its limits as we unlock the secrets of the universe. Fasten your seat belts and get ready for liftoff. Uh, our voyage begins with galaxies. The building blocks of the universe imagine islands, not of land and sea, but of stars, gas and dust. Galaxies are enormous structures held together by gravity. Some galaxies contain hundreds of billions, others trillions of stars. Within these galaxies, stars are born, live, and die. Let's now turn our attention to our own galactic home the Milky Way. From our vantage point on Earth, we see the Milky Way as a band of light stretching across the night sky. If we could travel beyond our galaxy and look back, we would see a magnificent spiral structure. Our Sun is located on one of these spiral arms, about 26,000 light years from the galactic center. At the heart of the Milky Way, lies a supermassive black hole, an object so dense that not even light can escape its grasp. The Milky Way is just one of billions of galaxies in the observable universe, but it's our home. Galaxies come in a variety of shapes and sizes. Some, like our Milky Way, are spiral galaxies. Others are elliptical galaxies with a smooth oval shape. And then there are irregular galaxies with no defined shape. Galaxies range in size from dwarf galaxies containing a few million stars to giant galaxies harboring trillions of stars. While galaxies may appear to be vast and unchanging structures, they are actually in constant motion and sometimes their paths intersect. These galactic collisions are slow, drawn-out events that can last for billions of years. As galaxies approach each other, the gravitational forces begin to distort their shapes. 
these collisions can trigger intense bursts of star formation and ultimately lead to the merging of the two galaxies into a single larger galaxy. In fact, our very own Milky Way is on a collision course with our nearest galactic neighbor, the Andromeda Galaxy. Uh, beyond the galaxies, the vastness of space. We've explored the wonders of galaxies, these islands of stars scattered throughout the universe. But now let's journey into the vast emptiness that separates them, a void that's far from empty itself. This is intergalactic space, a realm of unimaginable scale and profound mystery. Intergalactic space is filled with sparse gas, remnants of past galactic collisions, and uh, perhaps even particles of dark matter, an elusive substance we can't see but know exists through its gravitational effects, through its beyond the galaxies, the vastness of space. We've explored the wonders of galaxies, these islands of stars scattered throughout the universe. But now let's journey into the vast emptiness that separates them, a void that's far from empty itself. This is intergalactic space, a, a realm of unimaginable scale and profound mystery. The fabric of the cosmos, understanding space-time. To grasp the immensity of space and how the universe works, we need to shift our thinking. We often imagine space as an empty box, but that's not accurate. Picture instead a flexible sheet, a cosmic trampoline. This sheet is space-time, the fabric that combines space and time into one entity. Stars and galaxies bend and warp space-time. This warping is what we experience as gravity. The Big Bang Echoes of Creation Let us now rewind the cosmic clock, journey back to a time when galaxies, stars and even atoms did not exist. We are going back to the Big Bang, the event that marked the birth of our universe. Imagine a point of unimaginable density and temperature, a singularity where all of space and time were compressed into an infinitely small point, then suddenly an explosive expansion, a burst of energy unlike anything we can fathom. The universe is not static, it's constantly evolving, constantly growing. One of the most profound discoveries of the 20th century was that the universe is expanding. Imagine baking a loaf of a raisin bread. As the bread rises, the raisins move farther apart. Galaxies are like raisins in the dough of space-time. As the universe expands, the space between galaxies stretches. Our journey through the universe takes us to the heart of galaxies, to regions where stars are born. These are stellar nurseries, vast clouds of gas and dust. Imagine a cloud of hydrogen gas spread out over trillions of miles. The core becomes denser and hotter, igniting nuclear fusion. The birth of a star is just the beginning of a long and fascinating journey. Stars have life cycles, periods of growth, maturity and eventual decline. A collapsing cloud of gas and dust forms a protostar, a hot, dense object. As nuclear fusion ignites in its core, the star converts hydrogen to helium, releasing energy. The main sequence phase depends on the star's mass. As the star nears the end of its life, its hydrogen fuel dwindles. 
Its core contracts and the star expands into a red giant. A star's fate depends on its mass. Low mass stars leave behind a, a dense core called a white dwarf. Massive stars explode as supernovae, seeding the universe with heavy elements. For centuries, humans have looked up at the stars and wondered if other planets existed beyond our own solar system. Now, thanks to advancements in astronomy, we know the answer is a resounding yes. We live in a universe teeming with planets, exoplanets, worlds orbiting other stars. Some similar to our sun, others vastly different. Each discovery expands our horizons, challenging our assumptions. Chapter 4 Exoplanet Extremes Gas Giants, Super Earths and more As we venture deeper into the realm of exoplanets, we encounter an astounding array of worlds some so bizarre and extreme that they seem ripped from the pages of science fiction. Take for instance hot Jupiters, uh, gas giants that orbit scorchingly close to their stars, their atmospheres puffed up like giant balloons. Then there are super Earths, rocky planets, significantly larger and more massive than our own. Some of these su super, uh, super Earths May, may possess thick atmospheres and oceans of liquid water, while others might be barren and uh, volcanic. And then there are rogue planets, worlds that drift through the galaxy without a star to call their own. The search for exoplysome is still in its early, uh, its early stages, but with each new discovery, we gain a, a deeper appreciation for the incredible diversity of worlds that exist beyond our own. Chapter 1. Our Cosmic Backyard. A closer look at the solar system. Let's now return home to our own cosmic backyard, our solar system. Our solar system is a family of celestial objects bound together by the sun's gravity. At the center lies the sun, the star that sustains life on Earth. Orbiting the sun are eight planets. From Mercury to Neptune, our solar system is full of beauty and extremes. We also have moons orbiting the gas giants and comets. Our solar system is a dynamic place shaped by the force of gravity. Hmm. Chapter 2. The Dance of Earth and Moon. A celestial partnership. The relationship between Earth and its moon stands out. This celestial dance is a gravitational partnership. The moon is a cold, airless world, its surface scarred with countless craters. The moon plays a vital role in making Earth habitable. The moon's gravity creates the rhythmic rise and fall of ocean tides. The moon prevents Earth's axis from wobbling too much. It stabilizes our climate. And the moon has been a source of inspiration for humanity. Our journey through the solar system now takes us to the inner planets. Rocky worlds that bask in the sun's heat. These planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth and Mars, are vastly different from the gas giants. Mercury, the smallest planet, is a world of extremes. Its surface is heavily cratered by asteroids. Venus is a cautionary tale of a runaway greenhouse effect. Its thick atmosphere traps heat, making it the hottest planet. Earth is an oasis teeming with life, its atmosphere sustaining us. And then there's Mars. 
the red planet with a thin atmosphere. Evidence suggests it once had a thicker atmosphere and flowing water. So, chapter 4, the outer giants, gaze giants and their entourages. As we venture beyond the, the asteroid belt, we enter the realm of the gas giants. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune are vastly different from the rocky worlds of the inner solar system. Jupiter is a swirling ball of gas, its atmosphere a tapestry of colorful bands and storms. The Great Red Spot is a massive storm that has been raging for centuries. Saturn is renowned for its magnificent rings and has a more serene atmosphere. Its rings are a testament to the power of gravity to sculpt matter into intricate structures. The ice giants Uranus and Neptune are more distant and less well-known siblings. Uranus is tilted on its side while Neptune is a deep blue world. These gas giants are orbited by a plethora of moons. Chapter 1 Cosmic Odysseus Our fantastic voyage through galaxies, space and the universe has taken us from the familiar to the extraordinary. We began at our pale blue dot, Earth, a tiny haven of life nestled within the vastness of the Milky Way. We journey to the heart of galaxies, witness the birth and death of stars, the swirling ballet of gas and dust, and the awe-inspiring power of supermassive black holes. We explore the concept of space-time, a mind-boggling fabric that shapes the cosmos and governs the dance of celestial objects. As we travel through the cosmos, we gain a deeper appreciation for the scale and grandeur of the universe, its beauty, its mystery, and its capacity to inspire awe and wonder. Chapter 2 A Universe of Possibilities Our exploration of the universe has just begun, each new discovery pushes the boundaries of our knowledge, urging us to seek, to explore. The universe is a vast ocean of possibilities. What new wonders await us in the cosmic abyss? Will we find evidence of life on other planets? Will we unlock the secrets of dark matter and dark energy? And will we one day venture beyond our own galaxy? These are questions for future generations to answer. Our journey through the cosmos is far from over.